Hey there, treasure friends. Here I am back for day number three. Got the convent behind me. And I'm looking at the church right now. Sun's shining nice. Maybe we can get out here and find a little more of that treasure we like to find, hey? What do you say? Come along? Let's do it. So today I'm going to pick up where I left off with Lyle at the end of day one, down the first side here, and then we'll work our way over to the middle. From there, just up behind me here. Also, in other news, I'm trying out a little bit of chest mount with my action cam today. See if uh, I can get a little live dig out of it, maybe catch something awesome coming out of the ground. Okay. I'm gonna ground balance and start chasing those beeps. Let's do it. All right, guys, just working my way around this tree where Lyle and I had left off. Digging a few things in the 60s and 70s was total junk, of course. But here, got my first signal in the 80s, and what did we pop out of here? Look at this. A really nice penny here. You can see the queen. Looks like it's a 1974. Look at that. Decently old for our first coin. Right on. Gonna keep digging them. Gotta be digging really careful under these trees here. Just pop this little plug here and I got a Christmas light base here. See, it's got a little piece of glass sticking out of it. Gotta be careful. Same like before when we were over here, there's tons of pennies in here, but you gotta dig all these signals cause it could be a coin or it could be a ring. And look, wrapped in a little grass sleeping bag in the dirt. We got another penny here. And as you can see, it's a 1977 queen on the back. Right on. Keep on going. All right, if I don't give it a try, I'm never gonna record a live dig here with this action camera. So here we go. Already cut it a little. Let's flip it open. Oh man, look at that. Dream squasher. <laughs> That's what I get, first live dig. Right last plug was right here. Now we'll just move over this tiny little bit. And right down there, you can see, pick him up and he's on a little bit of grass even in there. That's just weird. I guess they take it down with them. I've seen it over and over again in here. And what do we got? Wow, look at this one, 1969. Looking good. Where are you, Queenie? That one might have a little ding from the lawnmower on it. She's in there. Right on. Making me think about classic muscle. All right, I got another old penny signal right here. So let's see about live digging this one out. Been pretty on target with all the other ones. So hopefully, we can get this guy in one shot too. There we go. Ooh. A shaky. Yeah. Let's see if I can bring it up a little bit here. Okay. Okay, so right here, just a little deeper. Sorry guys. I can't keep this thing on target. I guess I need a head cam for this. Let's see. 
And if you see here, oh, turn her off, coming right on out. Look at that. Another penny. Oh no! Let's switch cameras and take a look. Nothing special, just a 1991 penny. We knew it was a penny before we popped her open. I got a little jumpy one here. We'll see what it is. Anywhere from the 60 to 80 mark, depending on which way I'm going here. Let's see what's there. It's just beautifully sunny out right now. And I can't get away from this little spot where I started here. Popped another plug and I got a little double find. Check it out, a little treasure and a little trasher. So I pop open a little hole over here and I got this 1988 penny, but I also got this period specific happy up. Anyone remember happy pop growing up around here? I'm sure it was lots of places too. Good old nostalgia find right there. Happy up and an 88 penny. I was probably drinking that when I was eight years old. Came back over to the car for a drink. Getting pretty hot in the sun. Needed a little refreshing. Thinking about it over there. Dug a bunch of trash after that last penny and bottle cap. And I'm thinking, why am I over there still? You know, as a completionist and a treasure hunter, you just can't stop till you're done. But I can always go back there. I want to try a different side of the park here. See what we find. What do you say? Let's go. So just across the way from the convent, showing you before a little bit, is the church here. And it's got this row of really old spruce trees up in here. And the sidewalk going through with lots of traffic. So let's see what we can find around in this neck of the woods in Baptiste Park. All right, I'm gonna start swinging. All right, just started right along this side of the sidewalk, working my way towards the trees here. Got my first good signal right over here. And what did I pop out? Looks like American. Let's see here. Yeah, Memorial. Scent. What's the year? There we go. And it is a 1981. Right on. First find on this side of the park. A little different than the last Canadian one. Still a penny. Right on. Just staying in this little area along the spruce trees and then bounded by that first brick path. Something weird just over there in the middle, a giant signal reading about 65 to 70 on my TX850. Nothing to dig though, cause I don't need to bring home a meteorite. Now here, already put the little plug back, but look what we got here, friends. That's right, an old one. It is a 1972 penny and unfortunately, I rookie scritched her with the knife. That's okay though. Can't really get the queen off the back of there, but that's okay. We know what she looks like. A lot younger on this one. Right on guys. Let's see what else I can get. And finally, here we go guys. I think I got something that's not a quarter. I could see the edge of it when I pop the plug. Let's go down and check it out. All right, so just over. And down here, still in that spot I was talking about, we popped out this little plug here. And yeah, what do I see there? Oh, look at that. We got us our first quarter for this park. I can't even believe it, it took that long. We got a lot of dimes and a lot of pennies. But now here, we got our first quarter. Oh, I seen the date right there. It's a 2008. Can you see it too? 2008. Caribou. 
coins with animals. Shout out to straight up metal detecting. So just a little bit more over, popped another penny, came right out of the plug. Where's his little grass hat? Yeah, right there, see? Boop. Okay, Penny, let's see what you got. This one is, oh yeah, nothing too old. Just a 1991. Yep, 91. Okay, guys, down here, we got a mystery lumpo. It's right inside this. What y'all think it is? Am I gonna hurt myself trying to open this with one hand? Oh yeah, it's sharp. It almost poked me. Yeah. Ah, super danger spike right here. Okay, let me get it out with two hands here and I'll show you what it is. And there you go. That's why we're always being careful with those 50 to 60 signals. This is another Christmas light base, big old one. Super sharp corner there, it's like a needle. And there's even a little, a little glass poking out. Well, boo to this one. Better luck on the next one. Probably just another one. Christmas light, it's right an inch over. Not gonna waste my time with that one. No dig. Two feet over, beep beep. I'm gonna bet a penny, hoping for something better. Yeah, it's a little jumpy. We'll see what we get. Disappointed face. Piece of aluminum garbage. Dang, what a swore it was, a coin or a ring. So I went over to that second spruce tree came back across this way and right under here see these two concrete blocks getting a signal high 80s or 90s right under the middle and i'm kind of thinking time capsule it's not marked why else would they have that covered like that who knows i'm gonna leave it alone because right over here i beeped another super high in the 80s just breaking into the 90s signal and look at this we got a dime, yeah. And here we go. It's a 1974. Oop. Say hi to the queen. Yeah. Got us a dime. Pretty sweet. We're just closing off the last pass down the edge of this path, and looky here, I popped a really dirty and corroded one here. It's uh, really hard to make out, but this one is actually a 2001 penny. Let's see right there, 2001. The newer they get, the older they look when they come out of the dirt. Junk. So I just did that 2001 penny and now here is a 2001 dime. But look at that. It like seriously almost has a hole in it there. It's really pitted in that one spot. Anyway, not important. See, look at that. Both sides. 2001 dime. Really had a chunk of crap in the construction there. Huh. All right, let's keep doing it. Almost done this stretch. We're cruising along and we got us another one. 70s penny, there's this little grass cover. There we go. Yeah, and here's the penny. Here we got a 1974. Yeah, Queenie's a little dirty. 
Another one here in this last little corner. 1987 penny. A couple more swings and it's supper time. By the way, I worked the last five nights. Had a coffee, maybe two, and ran the heck out of there. Could get some of this in before the kids got home from school. Now that's dedication to the treasure. They're probably missing me now though, I'm late. Finished whipping around that tree and came back around and beeped one more in the 80s. And it's another penny. This one's a 1985. Where are you, Queenie? There she is. 85. Whew. All right, stick with it. Let's go do a little bit of a roundup. Back at the garage. Right on, guys. Whew. We did it. Still gonna take another couple days, though. Oh, to finish the rest of this bad boy off. Baptiste Park, I'll be back. See you later, convent. See you later, church. We're gonna get your treasure. <laughs> so, semi-victorious, the treasure hunter returns to his automobile to go do the roundup. See you soon, guys. Time to roll. All right, treasure fans. Back at the garage for the roundup. Let's check out what we found day three at Baptiste Park here in Warrenville. It's smack dab between a hundred-year-old convent and a church on the other side. I searched a little bit in one spot, sort of where I had ended after the first video, and then I switched over to the other side and got a couple more things. All right, let's check it out. For the trasher, we have the Happy Up bottle cap. Something I couldn't see, it says Made in Canada, Diet Coke, Koala Springs, Colt 45. Top from a big lighter, little piece of foil, three pull tabs, aluminum garbage, got nailed twice, lithium cell, that was a surface find, loud as heck. We got the Christmas light bulb bases here, and also one other spiky piece of metal. And then one last thing here, this was a surface find, it didn't come up on the metal detector. And when I showed it to Aurora, she said that it is the gem from an ogre's ring. Right on. All right, on to the treasure. We got a penny as old as 1969. Pennies from the 70s, 72 up to 77. 1981 Memorial scent from the US then we got 85 in the 80s here our dime dime is from 74 then we're getting a lot newer here in the 90s pennies 2008 quarter another dime 2001 and penny 2001 they don't last once they get new. All right, still more to do in that park. Can't wait to get back. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.